we've got a puzzle here. I have left the combination to the vault door in several places in the street. You need to retrieve them. You'll only find your way out from the graveyard to the sea. Von Blood. Well, while that is certainly curious, it is not totally unexpected. It appears I too was trapped in a painting by Mr. Von Blut, who I believe also developed a fixation on me. I have only just escaped that painting with the help of Jane here, and in that escape we discovered that my painting was somehow connected to this place, to what seems to be your painting. If all you accomplish by escaping your painting must end up here in this wretched place with me, does that mean there is no way out? Is there no hope? There is actually quite a bit of reason to hope. It is my understanding that if you can find your painting, that by looking into it you will be taken back to your true home. That must be what he is referring to in his abominable letter. Oh yeah, well looking into your painting sure helped Nancy. It doesn't seem to have helped uh, Augusta here, or the woman on the left. She's still stuck! And now we've got somebody else who's stuck! This Camille! Everybody's gonna be stuck and it's terrible! Oh. I'm sorry, I should stop complaining. Which reminds me, I have not yet burned it today. See, do you see it being consumed in the fire? And yet... And yet, here it is again. No matter how many times I destroy it, and no matter how many ways, when I turn back to this table, it is always here. I have experienced the same thing. No matter what you change, when you turn and look back, it is always the same again. I am quite interested in the combination to that vault door. If I read the letter correctly, the combination can be found on the streets below. Yes, I would agree. But knowing Farm Blute, I am sure it would not be straightforward. Yes, that cursed wretch would never make something easy or simple. I believe he lives to torture others. Whatever he has done, if the way to open that vault door is available, we will have it. Interestingly, I'm not sure that it means anything, but when I look out my window, I'm almost certain that there is a difference in the street names. I mean, I think the street looks slightly different in this painting than my real street. Perhaps I could be a start to finding the combination to the vault door. That sounds like an excellent place to start. Could you show us the change you have noticed? After so many years, I cannot be absolutely certain, but I believe the street signs are different. Have you ever tried guessing the combination? If it were only that simple, as you see, there is a keyway above the dial which appears to lock the tumblers so that the dial cannot be turned. So without that key, there is no way to experiment and discover the combination. Sounds typical of Von Blute. Leaves everything just beyond your reach. Well, it appears our only recourse is to face your greatest fear. I could never do that. It is just too horrible, too unspeakable. My greatest fear was drowning, which I faced with Jane's help, and my desire to return to my family. I have no close family, and as for friends, I am sure they are all long departed. Still, to leave, we must go out into the street below. What do you believe will be waiting for us there? It may not sound reasonable, in fact, it is quite embarrassing to even say it, but for whatever reason, my greatest fear is being attacked by a werewolf. Well, from my experience, whether it makes sense or not, I think we can count on a werewolf prowling the streets below, waiting for a victim. Yes, Augusta. On that point, I believe you are absolutely correct. Do we have anything we could use to fight off the werewolf, or to drive him away? I have considered that, and have always come up blank. I have no weapons. I have nothing. Interestingly, Augusta, I have this necklace that your daughter gave me to bring to you. However, things have been so busy I had completely forgotten about it until just now. Yes, I know this necklace. I didn't think anything of it at the time. Okay, excuse me. What? Since when has Jane been carrying a necklace for Augusta from Nancy? I don't remember that being a conversation, and I don't see it in my inventory. Huh. But if I am not mistaken, the pendant may contain leaves of the silver gray wormwood plant. I have seen this many times in our gardens. It always has a lovely gray color. I was given this necklace by my grandmother, who was always a bit of a superstitious type. 
If I remember right, she gave it to me with the injunction that it would repel werewolves, which I remember thinking at the time was completely ridiculous. I am not an expert, but as I have had an obsessive fear of werewolves for as long as I can remember, I know something about charms that are supposed to repel them. Does that mean you have a collection of them? Yes, I do. But unfortunately not here. They're at my country home. But I can tell you that the silver grey wormwood leaves are supposed to be one of the best ways to drive off a werewolf. Well, then perhaps I will have to rethink some of the things my grandmother told me. At least we have a place to start. Are you with me, Augusta? Yes, I'm determined to return to Nancy. And hopefully Henry. Cecilia. We will depend on you to remain at the front door to let us in quickly should we have to run for our lives. I can do that. At least, I think I can do that. My only fear is fainting. We will be depending on you. I will persevere, as I want to be out of here more than you could ever imagine. We will survive. Now, for when we should try this, is it always night as we find it now with the full moon, or does morning come? It is as you see it now, always night, always a full moon, and never morning. Well, then I don't suppose it matters when we make our first attempt, so it might as well be now. The sooner the better. Let's go down and I will assume my post at the door and be prepared to facilitate your re-entrance at a moment's notice. No one could ask for more. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes, I am sure. And I also. Well, I suppose we are in for it now. Yes, are you very afraid? Some, but more determined than anything. I feel that same determination, and I am so thankful to have a friend like you as we go through this nightmare. Now, to check out that anomaly. It was like five minutes ago when they mentioned this anomaly. I don't remember what they're saying. Something about a a lamp post or street name being incorrect which direction was it to the left it, it's hard to see and it's also kind of hard to imagine that this woman was trapped inside this town for decades never bothered to venture outside I mean I get it she's scared of being attacked by the werewolf but at the same time you think she would eventually like wander outside so I can't see anything. It's very dark. Oh, here we go. This must be it. That must be it. Jane, can you mention... Okay, let me maybe visit it from this angle. Three right, 55. Two left, 74. Three, right, four. That seems useful. Hi, are you hiding behind me? No, I don't. Don't know. Can I spin around and see her there? There, okay, she's just following me. Okay, so we found the combination on our first try, which is why... Camille shouldn't have been hiding for so long. The solution was really super close the whole time. Now for the anomaly that she mentioned. In what direction can this anomaly be found? Okay, this was the town. That's the entrance to the town. <laughs> Ow! Get out of my face! I am trying to avoid being attacked by a werewolf. A werewolf which is not here. So which doors do I go through, by the way? Is, is this the house? I mean, this is one that's kind of well lit. Can I talk about what I found? Hi, we found something. Can we tell her we found the 3589... Can we? No, we can't. Okay, we'll tell you what. In the next video, we'll continue our search throughout this uh, strange werewolf area. Oh, here we go. Here's the safe. It's stuck. Right, we need to find the key first. We need to find the key first. Well, we already have the combination, so what's, 
What's the big deal? And I presume that door doesn't lead anywhere because whenever we try going through the door, we teleport right back to where we are. Cool.